The OnePlus 9 launched in India is not at par with the international variant of OnePlus 9. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And I just woke up, saw this video, and you know, I was like really pissed off, is what I should say, because OnePlus is at it again. The OnePlus 9, which they are selling in India, is not at par or is not even the same model which they are selling in the international market. So here we are on the official website of OnePlus India. And this here is oneplus.com, which is the official website of OnePlus in the United States, as you can see by the price. So before we get down to business, a few important things. OnePlus 9 has no OIS. It is a plastic frame and who knows what Gorilla Glass they are using because they did not mention it. The OnePlus 9 Pro has Gorilla Glass Victus, but no word on what Gorilla Glass is being used on the OnePlus 9. So these are the common things across both the Indian and the international models. Now let us get down to the differences. So as you can see, the Indian variant is lighter at 183 grams and the American variant has 192 grams and the same applies for thickness as well. So the Indian variant will be slimmer at 8.11 mm and the American is at 8.7 mm. The width also might be a bit different, right? It is 7.39 centimeters, which should translate to 73.9 mm and we have a 74.2 mm device here. Now let us move over to the other specs or the other differences so right here what do you have in performance you see wireless charging is missing on the indian variant of the one plus nine the international variant has 15 watt wireless charging why one plus why am i paying less money what what the heck's going on and then another thing which is super irritating would be your connectivity so here it is the connectivity section have a look at those 5g bands the special people of india who are foolish enough get only two 5g bands america bunch of 5g bands i see people bunch of 5g bands and you know ranjit explained this very nicely in his video so i have linked his video in case you want to get into the details but the bottom line is they save money by not including all the bands. I'm not sure whether you know or not, but the same applies for 4G bands as well. As you can see, the 4G bands are less as compared to that of the American variant. So let us say you are traveling, right? You are an international traveler who owns a OnePlus 9. Now you have to check whether you will get 4G in the country to which you are going to if you own the Indian variant of the OnePlus 9 sucks, right? I mean, why? I am not like paying 10 grand or 20 grand. I am paying 50,000 rupees for this phone. And this is what I get. Absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous, right? And then another thing I noticed is in the sensors section. Here you see flick detect sensor is where it ends. The front RGB sensor and barometer are not mentioned. What the heck's going on? And before you ask me what is this front RGB sensor, well, this is a sensor on the front of the device, of course. It does mention front over here. But the use of this sensor is that it is going to check the environment, see the light, and then adjust the white balance on your phone. Something which Apple calls True Tone, Google also has it and then OnePlus calls this comfort tone. So on the Indian variant, on their official website, the specs do not mention the front RGB sensor. And this is not something new. The OnePlus 8 Pro had this sensor and the OnePlus 8 did not have this sensor. So me personally, I do not have the Indian variant or the international variant for that matter of the OnePlus 9. 
but if you do have the Indian variant of the OnePlus 9 you can go into settings and display if you see the option for comfort tone then you have this sensor if not then the front RGB sensor is also missing and the barometer is also missing so let us do one thing let us go out and check the specs of OnePlus 9 Pro so here it is phone let us go into OnePlus 9 Pro and this of course we are on the Indian website I do not want your experience let me get into the specs so here it is specs of OnePlus 9 Pro and we will do the same thing for the US variant as well the page has loaded and of course everybody knows this hassle bad thing which they did the cameras are still not at par anyways so let us check the sensors over here and see what is going on with the sensors so here it is again front RGB sensor and barometer and this here is the Indian variant yes so the OnePlus 9 Pro in India mentions the front RGB sensor the OnePlus 9 does not mention that so if the Indian variant is being made cheaper right you do not have wireless charging you have less 5g bands then you also have the missing sensor which includes the RGB sensor which is comfort tone and a copied feature of Apple's true tone then what the heck OnePlus what are you doing and I know OnePlus fanboys and those glorified salesmen they won't point this out or they will say oh OnePlus will enable these features after a software update well if the hardware is there they might have to enable it because people like us people like Ranjit who are true to their viewers point these things out if you go by and follow those glorified salesmen you would never even know that these are the differences right so people need to be aware of who they follow I mentioned this a lot of times in my videos but you need to be aware of who you follow and the bottom line is the bottom line which I have seen is OnePlus is the favorite brand of big YouTubers big blogs it is very rarely that I see people who get free devices criticize OnePlus for anything I mean they will criticize everybody they will criticize Xiaomi Google Apple Realme but OnePlus they don't criticize oneplus and i don't know why there's nothing special about oneplus anymore oppo is taking over so i would actually like to wait and see that now that oneplus is getting shady with their things and not being truthful to their customer let me see how they respond another thing i would like to mention about their shadiness is here in the united states right if you try to buy the oneplus 9 5g the only variant which they are selling is their top end variant the variant which is hundred dollars cheaper they are not selling that in the united states why because they say that the variant which is i think 8 gb or whatever is like delayed i'm like seriously oneplus we all know what the heck's going on here big daddy oppo is taking over so just a small video letting my viewers know about the differences between the international and the Indian variant of the OnePlus 9. And that will do it for this video. Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.